The pencil case painters refers to a group of artists that all studied at the University of Canterbury School of Fine Arts in the late 80s and early 90s. We think of those people as Shane Cotton, Peter Robinson, Bill Hammond, Seraphine Pack, Saskia Leek, Tony Della Tour. The term pencil case painters was coined by Lara Strongman from a show that she curated with Robert Leonard in 1995 called Handover, where she refers to the artists that were from the Christchurch School as being like pencil case painters. By that she means the, the types of marks that they were making were often quite cheeky, quite raw, quite childlike, a bit like what you'd expect to see on the pencil case of a year 10 student. It was very clear with this group of artists that they influenced and bounced ideas off each other. I'm particularly fond of Shane Cotton's landscapes where he has added symbols onto that landscape. Symbols that reflect what was happening at the time in terms of colonisation and the influence of religion and Catholicism on the Māori people. Tony Delatour's approach to the landscape that he once said looked completely empty was to add his own actors. And for him, they were symbols from popular culture, tattoo designs, lightning bolts, numbers, animals, things that were more about identity for him. For me, it's nice to be revisiting this moment and looking at the artists that work together, live together, and learn to be artists together.